Where would you say that you uh, kind of make the biggest improvement from last year to this one? Uh, probably just maturing. I think I've improved in a lot of aspects, whether that's film or it's recovery. That's one of the biggest things I've really been harping on is recovery to take care of my body because I want to make sure I'm good in the long run. How important was the way that you ended last year to give you some momentum going this year? Uh, it was really good. I mean, I've been itching to play. Uh, I feel like ending the season off on a good note was going to give me some more confidence coming into this uh, week one. What's kind of the next step that you want to take this season? Uh, definitely being an overall receiver, like a, be able to do anything. Uh, I feel like I want to be the guy that they can go to on third down. I want to be the guy that can open up a game with a big play. I want to be a guy that could be clutch in certain situations. So I just, I've just i been trying to hone in on my technique and be a mature player on the field. How has your chemistry grown with Avery from, I guess, when you guys first arrived to, to now heading into week one of your second year? Uh, I feel like it's it's probably gotten even even better because we, we still do the same things we, we did last year. We're throwing after practice, uh, getting together on a day off and just going to throw, going to K Kansas City to throw. So, I mean, I feel like we have a really good connection and I feel like he has a good connection with the whole receiver room, honestly. Do you feel like there are more options, more playmakers at wide receiver this year than you've had in the past? Absolutely. We just got uh, Dante Cephas, uh, got Keegan Johnson, Trey Spike. We got a lot of good guys, uh, J-Jack. A lot of guys, a lot of guys have played a lot of football, so they know a, know a lot about the game, and I feel like that can help the whole room in a lot of aspects. What is it about your quarterback that, even though he's a sophomore, everybody seems to uh, really respect him like he's an up, upperclassman? Uh, probably just the way he works. He comes in every day, he puts his head down and works. So, I think everybody in the whole building respects that, and uh, he uh, he's not really a like a get out and yell at you type of guy, but he he can take things serious whenever he needs to. What is Dylan Edwards going to do for your offense this year? Uh, I feel like he keeps the defense on her toes because he's a really explosive player. Uh, it's really ex I'm excited to see what he does with us. Coach Kleiman said today he wants the offense to be more explosive, wants mm -hmm. some more home run TDs. When you hear something like that, does that excite you or what, what, what comes to mind? Yeah, that's stuff that makes you jump about the bed. That's a, that's a really uh, exciting, exciting to hear from your head coach.